Hello and good morning. Welcome back to my channel. This is Classic Beauty Over 60. My name is Denise and I'm glad you're here. I'm getting ready to go on just a really quick little um, mini vacation. It's just a couple days, but it's with a friend that I've never gone away with like overnight. So I'm excited. We're just going to go to the coast and um, play tourist. And I've I'm really familiar with that coast and so uh and she isn't so we're gonna I'll, I'll i'll play tourist guide which i love to do so i'm just gonna get ready and um i'll take you guys with us too all right so i just put eye drops in my eyes my eyes are always so horrible in the morning and i swear it made them worse and i am so, oh there i am wow i am so blurry in the morning I don't know if that's an age thing uh, and the tearing up like for no reason all the time, like especially in the morning for a couple of years there, I would do nothing but just tear up. Huh, I forgot to turn on my light guys. I thought I looked kind of odd. <laughs> oh, okay. There. Did I already say it's snowing? I'm watching a bird out there. <laughs> my poor plants, all of our poor plants. I don't know what the heck's going on with our weather, but all right, and then I got to do my hair. So I want to be kind of quick about it because there's a few things. I want to be kind of quick about it because there's a few things I've got to get done. I've, I've had more than enough time, but I procrastinated. And so now I'm going to have to pay the piper for that. So, all right. And so... Yes, I hope everybody's Easter was great. We had the kids over and um, my oldest son, his girlfriend has uh, a little boy and um, he is just amazing and he's so much fun and she brought him. And so that was a blast. Um, and it was too cold, not that we had Easter eggs for a hunt, but uh, it was too cold for an Easter egg hunt if we wanted to. So I'm just going to put my it bye bye under eye concealer under here and I like to apply it with a brush and then put it on with my fingers. I don't know why because really shouldn't make that much difference, but <laughs> all right. And so, yeah, super excited about this little trip. Um, it's about, oh. Um, I don't know, uh, like, um, like almost three hours away. And then when we get there, I was hoping, um, we could go, oh, about another hour away north and then the next day go south or however we want to do it, but meander our way through. I know some really great spots for viewing, um, for viewing uh, whales, um, we had a pod that lived around, I used to live at this coast, and um, we have a, a, pod, a pod of gray that live around there year round. So and I used to be a concierge at one of the um, nicer places there in, in on the coast that I'm talking about. And, um, and uh, yeah, you, you can see them all over. And I know the special spots just because I live there for, uh, like 13 years so I kind of got to know what I was looking at and I'm gonna go ahead and put my foundation on and I'm the blender <laughs> I like to blend the colors I don't do anything fancy I don't need any special tools to oops do this I do one squirt my gloomy lotion I've got I got some um some skincare that I want to show you guys. Uh, I do twice as much gloomy than, than I do my actual foundation. So it looks like that. Uh, yeah, I've got, I got a little bit of skincare, just niacin, but um, it's really good for your skin. And I, uh, I've got a bunch of great skincare that I've got that I'll go ahead and um, show everybody wh what I use. Um, my skin was way worse than it. It, it, way worse than it uh, had, had ever been, um, probably in my 40s. And then I started getting into skincare. And so, uh, 
your skin is your biggest organ and, and let me tell you, it really responds to things, especially if you haven't, you'd be so surprised if you just were faithful about putting on almost, on, honestly, almost any cream. If you've never put any on and you just started being faithful with putting some on, you would be so surprised at uh, the difference in such a quick amount of time because it's almost like your body, um, you know, wants it, like craves it or whatever because you have, haven't ever had it or haven't had it in a while. And that's another reason too, why I mix up my um, hair care and my um, face uh, serums and that kind of thing is to um, basically kind of keep my body guessing as far as um, what it what it needs. And so, uh, some things are always a staple, but I will add other things just to um, kind of give it the full spectrum of what I think it needs. And um, yeah, and there are certain things I was using before I knew, you know, what I was doing that I didn't need to use. Like I was using azaleic acid, which is azalea tree or azalea um bush uh derived acids and i was using that for my skin well i don't have rosacea <laughs> so i bought that for you know nothing <laughs> okay i'm sorry i've got my sorry couldn't find my okay so got the foundation on as always, I, um, I'm 60 years old and I have sagging, wrinkling. I have very textured skin from be, because in my youth I had a bunch of acne and um, it was pretty bad. And so I can't get rid of that, but for my age, I have hardly any wrinkles. So, um, and for the longest time, I didn't think I could use creams on my face because any kind of pr cream I used to use uh, would just break me out like nobody's business. So um, today I am going to use, because we're, I, okay, so it's gonna be a you know a little bit of a drive and then we're gonna go, you know, fool around and I don't plan on, you know, really touching up much once we get to the hotel. I'm gonna use the Infallible, um, it's waterproof and uh, I've got, I've got issues, I've got broken capillaries. And they have a pool there. So I am definitely gonna be pulling out this infallible um, waterproof to at least put where I'm putting it right now. Just put some in the corner of my eyes because that <laughs> it gets pretty dark. Yeah, and I appreciate that it's waterproof and it's light. And yeah, I like, like all of it. I have a little bit on my chin. Okay. Nothing else at the moment is sticking out <laughs> as far as being too red. All right, got to take that with me. I'm trying to separate my stuff out. I wish we were going for longer, but really I hate um, leaving the dog and oh, the cat's fine, but the dog I feel guilty about leaving. Okay, do a little contour. So, I am going to do this a little differently today. I'm gonna to use my um, eyeshadow brush only because I wanna Actually, I want to try a completely different thing. Sorry. This is what I want to do. I want to use my boing. I want to do something. I, I wanted to try to fool with my nose today a little bit. And. It's, it's snowing not huge flakes, but I don't like to put a whole bunch on my nose because my nose has really 
big um, pores on it. So try to avoid that a little bit. All right, now, and now I want to see Let's see if I do this. <laughs> I don't take myself too seriously, you guys. I just want to see. <laughs> I just want to see uh, if I can make my nose look a different way. I want to play with this a little more. When my mom passed. Um, my, my sister uh, was a beautician in, in um, uh, California. She went to Marinello School of Beauty and uh, she does a real bang up job of makeup too. And she did my mom's makeup um, for the her funeral years ago. But uh, that is, hmm, I don't know if that did anything or not. Oh, shoot, you guys will have to let me know. It's kind of, I see when I'm filming here, it's a little hard to see kind of like what you're doing sometimes. Okay, I'm going to use this with my Benefit. And gosh, you guys, I have so many um, things I want to show everybody that, uh, that I've learned along the way. Little tiny tips, silly things, but, but useful. Um, there's just not enough time in a day to do everything. <laughs> uh, okay. Oh, there's a place I want to go. It's, um, like a crystal shop and it's, oh, it's so, it's so pretty. They've got these giant crystals that look like the wings of a butterfly. They're amethyst, you know, like, oh, I don't know three foot tall type, you know, um, uh, rocks and it's just amazing. Uh, it's really cool. I'll bring you guys in there. I'm sure some of you have seen stuff like it before, but I'm sure some of you haven't. I mean, not each one of those stores is different in its own way. I'm still using this to sculpt out my neck, but Yeah, it's really beautiful. I'm really looking forward to it. And I just brought my friend up from there and took her back home. And um, I swear, since I left, and that was like, what, a couple of weeks ago? Uh, since I left, they've already got a, a new um, restaurant. Looks interesting and it's, uh, it's in a nicer area. I know the area, it's a nice area. Okay, and you'll notice I didn't put anything on my forehead. I barely touched over here, and I, I didn't touch my nose really at all, except for to sculpt it. Okay, and then we're going to take the Lani. Yeah, my friend, she stayed uh, a while, but I swear, we still didn't get everything done we wanted to get done. And I've got to send some stuff back to her because she forgot some stuff. And we both did the double look and <laughs> we both missed it. I don't even know how that how that can happen. But and so her, her, her birthday is towards the end of the month. So I guess I can just uh, send both. I can send what she left and I can send her present too. Can't say what the present is because she watches the channel, but I think she'll like it. It's a custom made thing and um, I, know she'll, I know she'll like it. I would like it. <laughs> oh, okay. So the snow just stopped and it's cause it's supposed to be like 53, which I know that's not huge, but um, I was hoping it wasn't going to be snowing with 53 degree weather. <laughs> okay, so 
I like that placement. That looks fine. All right, now I am going to, let's see. Well, so I'm gonna put on my, well, sorry, that's really shiny and out of, stop that. Anyway, it's the Milani and uh, it's this same color I've been using and proper brush for me for this is the big fluffy fluffy one i'm just gonna go the top ridge of my cheekbone where the sun would get me and my nose mm -hmm. i want to get my ear I gotta do my hair and so I was gonna wear cute little brought spring cute little spring dresses and then I looked at the weather there on the coast and it's like 41 <laughs> so maybe not well I I can bring the dresses but I'll wear them with I have some like fuzzy boots so I'm going to take this big brush and I'm going to kind of crimp it down, you know, like that and just put it at the top because I have personally, I, the reason I avoided my whole forehead really with foundation is because I have um, wrinkles right through here. They're very light, but I don't have any up at the top and I don't have any right above my brow. And so, the truth be told, I really wanted to make myself look more natural. I wouldn't use anything with any kind of glitter or satin or any type of deal like that um, so that it would look like my more like my skin. But I don't mind people knowing that I'm wearing makeup because I'm wearing makeup. <laughs> it's, it's okay. <laughs> okay, so let's see. I want to let's see okay so i'm gonna wear um like kind of like tan colors um i want to put this lip gloss on real quick because i just uh, just derma rolled my lips i derma roll my lips um almost every time that i uh, am going to go out it takes two seconds i brush my teeth i brush my lips brush my tongue brush roof of my mouth and then, um, you know, I just use that derma roller really quick. Do, 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 you know, do, 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 I'm done. And then, uh, this is that mm, City Lips. I forgot the color, but I don't like the color. So I'm just purely using it for its plumping ability at this point. All right, and okay, so I was starting to say I'm gonna wear beige. I had like tans. I know that's not very springy, but anyway, that's what I'm wearing. Uh, so I guess I've got I've got this this palette, um, which has these kind of colors in it. Sorry. Um. <laughs> See, I need some more palettes, huh? And I guess I could use this one, but I thought I remembered. This is the Pier. They're a bit sparkly. You know, I think I won't use those actually. And this other color palette's completely wrong. What else do I have? Um, well, golly. All right. I, I'm gonna go with this then. That's the one I'll go with. And this is the the Nudes by uh, Juvia. This one was especially pretty. It's kind of a satiny pearl. It's just real pretty, especially on the insides of your eyes, or in, inner corners, I should say. Which, uh, yeah, so what we'll do Actually, I'm going to mix it up a little bit because, oh, I forgot. I know those are for brows. Okay. I have, where is that? It's in here, isn't it? 
think I have like a transitional kind of a oh, I love this color pop palette for um, autumn but this is a good transitional color anyway um, I have to okay so I'm, I'm going to use this one right here Add it in so it doesn't skip over your soft eyelids that we now have. <laughs> so I don't think I have hot flashes anymore because I'm 60, but I don't know. Do the rest, does anybody else have like, if I, if I think about something that is even semi disturbing, I will start sweating like a hot flash. I mean, in the middle of the night too. And it's so di disturbing because it's like, I'm trying to sleep. Why am I thinking about the, the craziest things? And um, it's doing something to my nervous system. Uh, it's spiking me and making my um, body go into like a, not a cold sweat, but just a sweat sweat. So I don't know. I, I, is that normal? <laughs> I've never really asked anybody. <laughs> and based on what I'm thinking, it's, um, I know you guys can't, I know that looks, well, it is light, but I mean, it's, it's a perfect color. I wish you guys, I need a better camera, but <sighs> one day, well, now this will work. My husband just got a new uh, ga Galaxy. And I thought that the camera was going to be like my son's. And I thought he, I think he has a Galaxy too. But no, it's not even as good. I thought, oh, this will be great, you know. Maybe I can ask him to borrow the camera every once in a while. But he, um, I don't think it's, I think mine's better or at least the same. And I've got this, this is an older phone. It's an Apple, but uh, gosh, I got it in probably, uh, tw uh, maybe it's probably about five years old, something like that. It's pretty old. Okay, so I'm going to take this cover color from Juvia, the one that I've been using, and I'm going to go in the crease with that one because that's where I want to go with that one. I want to see that just a little bit, and then I'm going to... Kind of just pat it on and roll it up. The light touch and just don't go outside. Just stay inside from here, you know. Just don't don't go out that way. And just keep blowing that out until you think it looks indistinguishable from the color you just put on. All right. And uh, I'm not sure what color I'm gonna put on the lid yet. I love putting the satins on. And now I'm looking at that pure palette and you can just look at it and see. I'll have to actually put my finger in it again. Maybe it's got one of those kind of like waxy bases, which I, I appreciate those. But it doesn't look like it, and I can't remember. Um, like I said in uh, the previous video, I haven't used it in years. That's why it's so new looking. And I must not have liked it all that well, or else I would have used more of it, right? Okay, so what color should I... Uh, let's see. I... Do, 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 do. Um... I'll go, no, 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 no. Huh. Well, I know for sure I'm gonna put this right in the corner. And from the corner to the middle of my iris.
my friend is coming to pick me up at 10.30. And I've got, I'm not all the way packed. I did start, um, we had ham for Easter. And uh, so with the leftovers, I made a ham and potato with, uh, actually my husband cut it all up and I put the spices in it. Um, like uh, au gratin thing with cheese and all that um, in the crock pot so that while I'm gone, he, he has something to eat. Okay, you know that he doesn't have to cook with. He, he's he got a lot of work coming up, so he's gonna be really busy. All right, so, so yeah, let me try that pure and see, is it really as, uh, I don't know if you guys can tell, but it, Because if not, I like I like this color. I like that. Oh, where's my finger? I like that one right there. Uh, that's called gorgeous. Okay, let's see. Hmm. Actually, that's pretty. I was looking for a little more of a boom, and also I'm wondering which one to take with me. All right. So well. Let's go with that. Maybe this is the one I'll bring. It's just, okay. So I'm just gonna use that one, that gorgeous one. And I always like to apply the satins or the shimmers uh, with my fingers. It's just, it's a way better application. The other application that I like that I haven't done in a long time is have a little tiny bit of sterilized water in the old days, we used to use spit. That is not advised now. Um, and uh, uh, get your glitter um, shadow uh, a tad wet, you know, and use it with the brush. So you dip your brush into the sterilized water and then, um, you know, use it to line. As That's how we did it anyway. Okay, I, I like that. That's, that's pretty, it's subtle, um, which since I'm were and I haven't really ever gone out before because I like to have fun. So I come from Las Vegas. I had a fake ID at 15. Um, I was clubbing it at 15. And um, so I like to have a good time, but I certainly, <laughs> I don't get crazy. I never got crazy, but uh, do you like to have a good time and I don't know if you know what she how she likes to let her hair down so I guess probably what I'm saying is, is I, I'm gonna just you know see how it goes okay that's pretty it's pretty sedate is what it is but okay <laughs> it's just I like it it's just a little um, more shy than I was gonna go that's all right okay so I would like to get rid of my gels. So, uh, this is doo -doo -doo -doo, Revolution Ultra Contour. And as you can see, I've used it a lot. I need to get a new one, but frugal as I am, I'm not going to till I use up all my stuff. Yeah, even if I had more money, I still, I've had more, I've been there, I've done that. I've had it, I've not had it, I've had it. Uh, I still like to use my stuff up no matter what. So I'm going to go, really, a phone call? No. I'm going to go into this one, and it's like a mm, three shades darker with, with more of a brown tone than a gray tone. Be careful with that because, and it, of course that goes for your own skin type, but be careful with the grays because that can look um, weird and sallow. So... My issue is right here. Okay. I 
can see the little birds and they're chirping now. I hope that's all it snows and we're done there because last year ruined all my, I didn't get any pears. Well, I got one, one and it didn't, it died before it ever made it off the, off the tree. Okay, so now I am going to take a flat just lightly kind of buff what we last did I kind of like to buff the edges also I like to do this because as we're getting older uh, I can't see as well and uh, if I made a mistake or had too much of a demarcation line somewhere, I want to make sure I touch all of the parts of my face to get that um, get that out of there. You know, what time is it? Okay, it's eight o'clock. You know what? I, which I've never done here on 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 my channel. I might just go ahead and hmm. Do an eyeliner okay so this is benefit uh what is it roller liner i think it says so what i like about this it's super super thin and if you are new to aligning your lips and I'll, I'll probably do a whole other video on this just because um if you're new to lining your lips <laughs> Let's try that, shall we? You know, if you're new to lining your eyes and you're not comfortable, you like, you're like, oh, oh my gosh, I mean, no. What you can do is just lay it, you know, like, like, lay it, lay it, you know, like that. Sorry, I couldn't really see that, but you know what I mean? Um, yeah. Ooh, that's so good. Anyway, so, um, you don't want to go, you know, past your last lash. So you want to go here up to, I like to go to uh, the crease of my lid um, and don't go further out. And I like to do it at just a little bit of an angle. Actually guys, uh, so I've got a mirror over here and I'm gonna kind of look in that, sorry. But I, I, uh, I need to see what I'm doing. Okay. Okay, this isn't, <laughs> uh, this is hard to do on camera. So, it's pretty light, but can you see just the difference? Oh, sorry, what I like about these is the stuff is inside here, so every time you put it back in, it reloads. Anyway, anyway um, Look at the difference in my face as it's lifted, like, you know what I mean? So here, look. I don't know, I see a difference. And it's not so crazy high up there that it looks weird. All right, so let me, let me kind of perfect that and do the other eye and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. So both eyes are done. And um, I like doing my eyes like that every once in a while. I used to do it all the time when I was um, working at the front desk, well, in an office. Anyway, uh, it just makes me feel a little bit more ladylike and I just like the look. But um, yeah, all right. So the other thing I'm gonna do is this, this boing. I am gonna put that under so you can kind of see my troughs are right there, right there. 
I'm gonna put it under it. So when I lived in Las Vegas, my friend from high school was in, I don't know, I can't remember if it was the Follies per share or what it was. It was, it was or was it Ice Capades? I, I think she did go on Ice Capades too, but she, um, she, uh, when we go out on Lake Mead and, and go, you know, get our tans on and well, back when we didn't know tanning was so horrible for you, um, it, she would get in trouble, uh, find and a hefty fine at that if she had any, um, tan marks on her body because they had to do just that much more, uh, body makeup work on her before she could go on stage. <laughs> it was, it was pretty something. So, all right. So now, uh, let me look here. So uh, everything is looking fine. All right. So I, you know, I've always only just bought cheap, uh, eyelash curlers, but there's a couple of eyelash curlers I'm curious about. They have one, it's called Shu Umura. And, um, I guess it's supposed to be good. I'm not interested in the heated ones because it uh, I just don't like that. Uh, does anybody remember or did anybody used to take their, um, the last bits of their mascara and run it under hot water? <laughs> and then you'd put it on your eye and the, the chemical, your eyelashes and then the chemical because it was heated, was like giving off a vapor that like made your eye want to close. <laughs> oh my, crazy stuff we used to do. Okay, so. All right, I am gonna hold this. My eyelashes are stubborn. I need to get some eyelash serum, but I'm gonna wait for on that. But my eyelashes are very stubborn and they're um, coarse. So I'm going to hold this for a count of 100 and I'll speed through that. Okay. I'm going to use Bad Girl Bang. And it's waterproof. Uh, I really need to get some more. It's it's a little bit pricey, but the reason that I get the more expensive one is it usually, except for now, it's getting down to it doesn't give me spider eyes. Which back in the day I didn't mind that. Heck, I I tweeze those together to make them look like just you know three or four huge lashes. <laughs> I've always worn interesting clothes and uh, usually uh, interesting hairstyles. As I got older, the hairstyles kind of stopped, which is a shame and I'm trying to get back into it because, you know, if you're lucky enough to still have it <laughs> and um, you guys have seen my video or if you haven't, it's in there, it's under the playlist hair and I've got a lot of great information. So there's one eye. All right, I'm going to do the other eye and I'll be right back. Oh, no worries. No worries. Thank you so much, Casey. <laughs> bye. Yes. Bye. Okay. So, uh, I am going to go do my hair and get dressed and I'll be right back. Put a little lippy on. I don't go. To the very ends because that looks kind of odd. Um, especially as you get older, it can go in your wrinkles. If you have downturn corners of your mouth, it'll look like you're frowning even more than you already look like that. And that's what I'm trying to avoid. Okay. 
Okay, don't overline. Um, in the summertime, I will with a lighter color because you can't see it that much. And I will overline just a little bit on my upper lip, but, um, and then put a gloss over. And when you put a gloss over, you can't really see the, what you've done there. So this is Maybelline, um, matte ink and the color is, um, 176 ringleader <laughs> so it's, it's a pretty color and it, and it lasts uh lasts a while too so all right so we're gonna bring that and i forgot to do my eyebrows but honestly i'm not sure why but they they look pretty good <laughs> they're good enough and um so yeah, I'll do my hair and I'll be right back. All right, I finished the look and I'm ready to go almost. Need to get uh, some stuff put in the dryer and then in the uh, suitcase. I it Since it's snowing and raining, I put on that um, wax, that really light wax spray that I have in one of my um, shorts. And uh, yeah, that'll keep it my hair fairly dry and stuff. So I uh, have, because of the weather change, I had to make a quick um, clothes change too, but no biggie. I'm still excited to go. And I'm excited to show you guys uh, some of the scenes that I get to see. I wanna take you along with me. Uh, some of you I know are um, homebound and can't get out, or you uh, just would like to see other places. And I'm happy to take you. All right, guys, if you liked what you saw and you think it was interesting and it's something you'd be more interested in finding a little bit more about, um, like, subscribe, and I'll see you back here next time. Thanks. Bye.